Hello everybody, welcome back to, to another how-to tutorial and today I'm going to teach you how to fix GTA 5 not launching on Epic Games Store. So first, we're going. what we're going to do is we're going to make it so Windows doesn't delete your files and doesn't recognize that GTA 5 is a virus. To do that, we need to head here on your Windows key, then you go to settings, then after you go to settings, you go update security, then you go Windows security, open that up, go to virus and threat protection then you will go to manage settings you scroll down and you see and you look at exclusions as you can see here here is what we're looking for exclusions we're going to press add yes then we're going to add ex exclusion we're going to press folder then what you want to do is you go to the drive where gta 5 is downloaded so let's say um Where's my games folder? You're gonna find GTA 5. I don't have GTA 5, but you can find your folder named GTA 5. You're gonna press that folder, then you gotta select that folder, then there we go. If that doesn't still work, what you wanna do is you're gonna go to settings, you go for device manager. There we go. Then you look at your graphics card. We're gonna look for our graphics card here. It will be somewhere. here on your display adapters so what you want to do if you have integrated graphics you can just press this one you can press your amd or your intel integrated graphics then you're gonna update that driver then if you have you if you download it manually you can just press this or you can search online and find it and if that still doesn't work what you want to do is you head over here for example, if this is imagine this is GTA 5, you're gonna click here, then you're gonna click on manage, and you're gonna verify your files. What this do is the Epic Game Store is going to find any corrupted data or any corrupted file that needs to be fixing. If that still doesn't work, you can what you can do is you can just reinstall the game. Uninstall, then reinstall the game and yeah thank you for watching guys i hope that helps you and i'll see you on the next tutorial Bye bye